Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, everyone. This is Adobe Live, and I am your host, Chris Blackstock. It is 9.30 a.m. Pacific Standard Time, and we are here with Noah Aspen. Hi. Hello. Hello. How's it going? How's it's your going morning so good. far? It's really nice. I'm happy to be here. I'm excited. Awesome, awesome. We're very excited to have you. And welcome, everybody, to Adobe Live Pride Week. Woohoo! Yeah. Uh, this week, we're celebrating creativity uh, for all from the LGBTQ plus community and allies. So we're really excited for this week, excited for everybody to be on here. Um, also, hi, chat. Hi, everybody. How you guys doing? Um, excited to see everybody. Um, obviously, chat is the best part here because you guys can all participate. You can chime in and i think today it's going to be especially awesome because we're doing prompts today so everybody will be be able to chime in and, and see where we want to take this stream today um wade it's nice to have you on as always as moderator um also if you guys are watching on youtube hey how's it going uh you guys can hang out there but it'd be awesome if you guys came over to behance at b.net slash adobe live you guys can uh participate in the chat here with us and also get your number in quick for our prompts so It'll be super fun. Um, so yeah, uh, Noah, hi. Um, could you please introduce yourself, uh, show some of your work, where you're from, and just uh, let us know what we're going to do today? Yeah. Hi, I'm Noah. Um, I am queer. I'm trans. I am a Black Indigenous person of color, and I'm an artist. I have been an artist for as long as I could hold a pencil in my hand. I come from a family of artists. It's just something that I'm very passionate about. Um, I have pulled up here um, my Instagram. The uh, my Instagram handle is Aspen Aspirations. I draw a lot of different people. I like to draw my friends. I like to draw uh, myself. This is me, like loving who I am as a person. Um, I like to draw fat people. I like to draw black people and brown people. Um, I'm trying to show you one of them right now. Um, there we go. Uh, I um, I'm just so passionate about representation. Um, I like personally came out late in life, and I think that's because I didn't see people like me represented mm -hmm. in media, and so that is what I'm passionate about. And I want I want uh, to draw people where someone can look at that and be like, oh my gosh, that looks like me. So yep. yeah. That's awesome. what I'm all about. Awesome. Yeah. Well, cool. Do you have any, uh, any, so you show us some of your work. Is there any favorite pieces in there? Yeah. Um, so I really like these mushroom girls right here. Um, I actually made a sweater yes. of them um, that I have up at the link in my bio. And I also made this one that I'm wearing right now. Um, and it was for my friend Noah's top surgery fund. Um, right which on. Was really cool. So very cool. Yeah. I like it. <laughs> well, awesome. Um, yeah. So please uh, let us know what we're gonna do today. Really excited yeah. to get this rolling. Oh my gosh. So today we are going to be doing pride prompts. Um, I have a list of 16 prompts here. Um, we are going to unveil them one by one. I'm going to ask the chat to like call out a number. We're going to erase specifically that number prompt and reveal it. And then we're going to sketch it out. Um, today, we're just doing sketches. Um, and then uh, after we have like a whole page full of sketches, tomorrow, I want to pick one or two of those sketches and turn them into fully realized pieces. Um, so awesome. I'm really excited awesome. about it. Yeah, no, this is a great idea. This is really Thank fun. You. I haven't done this yet uh, hosting, so this is exciting for me. Yay! <laughs> um, so, yeah, does chat have any ideas for what number we should start with? Yeah, and just to let you guys know, the way we're going to do it is uh, Noah's going to ask you guys. She's going to say, okay, we're ready for the next one. And whoever gets the number in first in the chat, we're going to go with that. So, um yeah let's let's start also, it off and... this is my bad this should have been part of my intro my pronouns are <laughs> they he so yeah very you can right exchange on, right on. between the two it's good to know thank you yeah 
Okay. Looks like we got our first one. Stephen Booth, uh-huh. um, eight. All right, Stephen, let's do number eight. I'm going to zoom in so that I don't accidentally uh, erase something else. Okay, cool. Let's Ooh, the see. Slow reveal. Oh, we're going to draw some Cuddle people party. cuddling. Cuddle party. <laughs> Okay, super stoked about this. Love doing cuddling stuff. Um, I have a few different cuddle pieces uh, on my Instagram already because I just love drawing people cuddling. <laughs> I love that. I don't know if I have any cuddling reference. I gotta jump. We gotta get my reference game up here. Yeah, <laughs> I um yeah, I like drawing people like as if they're like cuddling and watching TV. Um, I also, one of my favorite uh, couples just like on TV are Marceline and Bubblegum from Adventure Time. And there's a photo of them cuddling together while like drinking some hot chocolate. And I think about that all the time. (laughs) (laughs) Like I want to live in that world. Yes, exactly. Everyone should be cuddling all the time. What if I drew some people like cuddling while like Maybe playing video games or something. I think that that could be cute. Perfect. And then something I like to do with that is that uh, their arms can be used as like the end of the photo because it'll Mm -hmm. like wrap everything up. Um, So I draw um, people with giant heads. Um, That is my thing. They always have heads that are so large. I've toned it down. Uh, since I've started uh, drawing, I I think like if you look at some of my first pieces, those heads are huge. The eyes, <laughs> giant. Um, <laughs> it's uh, it, it was definitely an adjustment. I I um I used to work with at like one of those really big theme park franchises uh, uh, in Orlando. And Mm. um, so I took a lot of inspiration from their works when I first started. Okay, these are going to be their little controllers. Even though no one has wired controllers anymore, I think it would be cute if they had wired (laughs) controllers. Yeah, no, you could get, you look, what if they need to be charged? right yes that's what's happening that that happens to me all the time it's like i gotta charge up (laughs) yeah my um my family has uh the kind of chargers where you have to literally put it um on the charger and you can't like play it while you're doing it yeah and um and so we all have to like do something else until the chargers are ready not <laughs> it's not fun I gotta go get one of those usb chargers i know <laughs> gotta gotta invest in those super important um nikki cousins is asking if the pride prompts are anywhere else and i believe the answer is nikki they're your secret they are secret we reveal them so yes we uh, don't know what the prompts are they're they're a surprise which is yes. exciting and i won't uh, know until i see them so i know i wrote forgotten. them right exactly (laughs) i have adhd they're gone (laughs) it's in the ether now yes uh, maybe we could do a play on like the like red and blue uh there's like a trope uh, with like gay characters where it's like there's red and blue like gays um and so we'll make one of them like representing two different like the red and the blue kind of thing like like, yeah like cool and and hot so maybe uh gotcha one of them will be like really angry about how their game is going they're like what the heck and the other one's like i don't care <laughs> it's all, it's all good. we're just we're just hanging out and having fun they're like no this is a competition <laughs> oh i also like to draw really big ears those are just like really fun for me yeah, I'll say something about with, you know, drawing, drawing big heads and big ears and stuff like mm-hmm. that is, is when, especially like when you're learning, exploring, and also if you're doing very stylized or cartoony work, mm-hmm. you know, there's so much of that personality and energy comes from the face. So it's almost natural to kind of go there first and make that your centerpiece, right? I mean, yeah, definitely. No, I absolutely agree. I feel like 
there's there's a reason why uh lots of cartoons have really big um really big heads and eyes yeah there it's we usually, go you know, your, your yeah your your face and your hands are where you do most of your emoting so especially in animation yes exactly okay there we go they're cuddling they're playing video games this one is nice. very upset and the other one is having a good time. Um, okay, so I'm drawing them really small because we're gonna end up with like a whole page of these. Um, right. I wanna see. Oh man, this is, it's like rapid fire. <laughs> that one was like quick, it. that one was quick, but. No, it's yeah. okay, I like it. We can, al well, we can always develop, you know, if we get through these really fast, we can always do some developing now. So you yes, know, absolutely. Day, so, yeah, there's no wrong way to do this, that's for sure. Okay, okay, so you ready for the next one? I'm ready. All right, everybody, you heard it. So put a number in there, and the first one that comes up, we're gonna go ahead and choose. What do you th What do you think it's gonna be? Mm, Eleven. <laughs> oh, I'll throw it I don't know. My, my eyes are. <laughs> Is Let's someone gonna throw eleven in the chat? <laughs> All right, I got it. It's uh, thirteen. Thirteen. Okay. Clever let's Devlin. See. Clever Devlin. She got thirteen. Let's see. Clever Devlin. Oh, you get to choose what I draw. Are you uh are you prepared for that responsibility? <laughs> All right, clever. It's it's up to you. Give me like you one word, two words, and I'll what I'll draw, draw something next? from it. We could draw some friends. We could draw a picnic. Um mm -hmm. I'm thinking of some some good words. We could draw kite flying. <laughs> yeah, kite flying. Yes, that's that was very Mary Poppins of you. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> do we have do we have a, a suggestion in the chat? <laughs> she all right, clever responded with uh <laughs> that um you know <laughs> not an answer yet. <laughs> that's a really good prompt actually. <laughs> Someone I guess we like should do a time confused. limit on responses. Too, just in case. <laughs> we we're twenty minutes. Yeah, yeah. Astronauts. Oh, well. Right, right. We're we're still waiting. We're like yeah, any any like, day uh, now when you're ready. All right, we'll um, go uh, at uh, at nine forty five if we don't get what we'll do. We'll choose another. Uh, okay, choose cool. another number just to keep things moving. Totally. Yeah, I've drawn space okay. lesbians before. All okay. Right. <laughs> uh, Clever Devlin wants coloring sidewalks. Oh, that's so cute. Yes, I'm so right, down. Love it. Love okay, it. let's do it. So coloring sidewalks. I love that. That was such a cool thing that happened when like um like uh, when quarantine had first started and everyone was mm -hmm. at home. Um everyone was coloring on the sidewalks and it was really so true. cute okay let's see um i guess i should draw like a little mock sidewalk there you mm -hmm. go mm -hmm. get a surface in there yeah look at how beautiful that is wow and then parallelogram i know parallelogram who <laughs> okay maybe we got some grass like peeking out because life finds a way. Yep. <laughs> there we go. I feel like Pride Month is like for me because um, my birthday is also this month. Um, oh, happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you so much. It's actually this week. So Ooh. if everyone wants to throw a happy birthday in the chat, you know. <laughs> I had a birthday a couple weeks ago. Oh, yeah. Happy yeah, birthday. Yeah, yeah. Wait, so nice. are you a Gemini? I'm a Taurus. You're a Taurus. I'm, yeah, okay. I'm right, right before the cusp. Oh, right, all right. So you could you could claim Gemini if you really wanted to. Yeah, I got some <laughs> of those Gemini traits. You know, I could, be, I could, I could go both. I, you know, this I could be this person. Right, right. right. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds Gemini to me. Yeah, <laughs> yeah exactly. <laughs> yeah, uh, I love it. I have a lot of friends who uh, are Gemini's and then also obviously born on or near Pride Month. And um, the best part of it is that a lot of times our um, 
our like birthday gifts consist mm -hmm. of um the like target pride merch or something <laughs> <laughs> Like, like oh. oh, we got each other the same shirt. <laughs> <laughs> right. Did you, you go, go to Target? <laughs> <laughs> You're like, ah, you so, so you also went to Target. Um, yeah. yeah, me too. I'm thinking of do, do they have a dollar section for <laughs> <laughs> they I I think that they, they like probably do. do. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure. I go there all the do. time, so I'm I'm gonna check now. Yeah. It's like, it's like the go-to spot once you're married and have kids. Right. <laughs> it's like, all right, I gotta get the diapers. And <laughs> From the dollar section of, of uh, Target. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all right, let's see. So I'm drawing, um, I guess, to me, this feels like a, like, 12-year-old or something. And um, they're chilling on the sidewalk. They are having a very peaceful time. Loving this pose right now. Thank you. Thank you. I'm trying to decide. I'm like, should I get her legs? Um, yeah. Yeah. Maybe like some cross, you know, like kind of kicked back and maybe cross in the back. Oh my gosh. Yeah. That would be really cute. Okay. Let's, uh, I'm starting out with some shapes. This is an interesting angle. There we go. Oh, yeah. Yeah? Yeah? Okay. All right. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. We got kind of, this. Yeah. We got this. Maybe even, you know, probably kicking the ground at some point and kind of tap, tapping the feet on the cement. Some drawing. Yeah. We got like. Look at that. Amazing. There we go. Oh, she's so cute. She's having such a good time. Maybe because it's pride, uh, she drew like a little pride flag. Nice. Which would look beautiful uh, and rainbow if we end up turning this into a full design. We'll look at me. We'll oh get. my gosh. I'm drawing upside down. Look at those skills. I know. Uh, I'm really proud of myself, actually. You oh my gosh. I'm Sorry, I get overwhelmed. Day. She's so cute. <laughs> it's fun doing these because you I mean you weren't expecting to do this one, right? So it kinda, wasn't. I, that's the best part about sketching, coming up with stuff on the fly and just yeah. making it happen. And then being excited about it and letting your mistakes box happen. Yes, the box of chalk. Okay. I feel like I've met so many people who don't even start drawing because they're worried about like it not being completely perfect. Um, totally get that. And uh, yeah, valid, valid fear. And at the same time, let your mistakes happen. Like. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Just it and turn your mistakes into something new. That's something that I learned from my dad. He would yeah. have us like sketch things without an eraser. Mm -hmm. Um, and he would just be like, All right, if you make a mistake, just do something new. Yeah, yeah, no, it's 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 a great, great lesson. And yeah. I mean, I think sketching kind of teaches you a lot about yourself, and it's it is, it's like something that you're going to constantly fail at. So it's, yeah, it's an important exercise because eventually you'll get you're going to succeed and get these amazing drawings and like right now these really happy moments that yeah. you can't can't get anywhere else. So this is so great. cute. Okay, she's beautiful. I love her. People that are was... loving it. Yeah, the chat is love. The chat is loving it. They're saying happy birthday. They're Thank they're you. saying nicely done. <laughs> so. I appreciate it, chat. Thank you. Um, yeah, no, this was such a good suggestion. I love this so much. I'm excited. There's two more of the, like, your choice ones in there. So those keep, are coveted now. Yeah, keep this an is, eye yes. out. <laughs> but yeah, there we go. That will be okay. my drawing uh, with chalk on the sidewalk prompt right. submission. I like this one. She's okay. beautiful. Okay. All right, chat. Next one. 
What right, number? You heard it. You heard it. <laughs> Let's get those numbers up on chat. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Just in case you don't know uh, what order the numbers go in. In case you guys them. don't know. Yeah, oh, that's true. We do need to see. So 8 and 13 yeah. are gone. We got mm -hmm. anything but 8 or 13. Here we go. There's one that looks especially short. There's some that have like, that look longer than other ones. Okay, so Valder uh, chooses five. Five. The first one in. Five. Valder, all right, let's do it. Boyfriend! Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> right. We're gonna do some boyfriends. Let's do it. I love it. Okay, here we go. Oh my gosh. So now I have to decide what the boyfriends are doing. Um let's see. Maybe the boyfriends are Oh, maybe they're they're at a pride parade. I should draw them Perfect. all like dolled up in their pride merch, and maybe they're holding a flag. Perfect. Like those those like classic photos. Let's do that. I I like doing things like uh, <laughs> one of them is very tall, <laughs> mm -hmm. and maybe one of them is very short. Yes. <laughs> I, I used to go I, I used to live in san francisco so yeah. i went went to many a pride parade up there that were really fun yeah um, oh yeah that's it was it was fun times i always had a great time up there um i used to have very long hair down to my shoulders wow like, super curly <laughs> me too <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that I know. I show, I show it to my little my little boys, and they're like, "Who's that?" <laughs> like, yeah. Oh, I love Young, that. a younger version of myself. Right, right. Okay, this arm was a little bit too high up. There we go. I actually um, have not been to like a proper pride parade. Um, because so i came out when i was like 24 i'm 28 now mm -hmm. okay. um and at the time i still didn't really know like what was going on with me um mm -hmm. and and i didn't really have anyone to go to pride with so right. uh i just didn't go and then once i like kind of figured out I was like okay I'm trans um I identify as queer because that for me it doesn't feel like I'm putting any limitations on like the people that I can interact with and love um right. and then I was like okay I know what I'm about and then like the pandemic hit <laughs> <laughs> so I was like okay cool great great yeah well I've got a lot more thinking to do now <laughs> You're right Maybe I'll figure out some more things about myself. <laughs> did that now did that um with that, did that mm -hmm. help at all as far as like reaching people online? Like did you have to were you able to like reach out in other ways or how like how did that Yeah like, are you so happy now that it's it's <laughs> over? You can finally get out and about and do all the things that you've been wanting to do. Um so wait, so do you mean like now that things have opened up or just like in in uh in well, the pandemic in general. Having, well, I, I guess were you having you were saying you're having a hard time kind of like finding finding people. Oh, uh, I yeah. Saying, were you able to find more of your community during that pandemic or was it kind of made it really difficult for you? Um, so I actually was able to find a lot of community during the pandemic. Um, I moved to Northern California. Um, and I started working from home. Mm -hmm. I, and in moving to Northern California, I ended up moving in with like 
are a wonderful couple um and they're like one of my best friends now their names are megan and michaela and um they're queer and they introduced me to the queer community in sacramento and awesome. that community is just so expansive and loving and uh welcoming and i feel like uh, people uh, have commented on like how I've only been here for like two years and they're like you know everybody Noah I just don't <laughs> how does everybody know who you are <laughs> that's I mean that's awesome that's yeah a great feeling. I mean I I still remember you know moving to San Francisco it was in 2005 mm -hmm. and I kind of you know grew up in a lot of sports and I I was just always the art kid yeah and i never really i, I just always kind of felt like i w wasn't a, with all the people that i wanted to be and when i moved to san francisco it just kind of it's like oh everybody's like you know especially in 2005 like it was just full of crazy weird awesome artists and just yeah you know, outcasts and 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 then and, and i felt home immediately so i i know that feeling of not feeling like you fit in and then finding a place and there's it's a it's an amazing feeling you know like you're just your mental state your health everything it's just oh my gosh you. yes and, and just meeting people you're like where have you been all my life like this is you know so that's awesome yeah no I absolutely agree I feel like um I didn't even realize how much like not really knowing who I was and how I fit in the world was affecting mm -hmm. my mental health. Like I used yeah. to get like so sad during like certain parts of the year. And um, I was just like, why am I so sad right now? And why do I feel like not good in my skin, you know? Um, right. And then once I came out and I started living my life um, more authentically, um, I found that like those big sad moments weren't happening anymore. Um, and awesome. it was just like super cool. Um, Aubrey uh, is chiming in here. Mm -hmm. uh, Aubrey's saying that uh, they do have a pride section in the dollar section at Target. <laughs> I got pan, pan, pan pride socks and they have decor and flags and sunglasses. Yes. So, we love to uh, see it. Andrew, uh, the awesome Andrew Hawkrattle says, Sacramento's the best. Sacramento so, is the best. Thank I you. I agree. Sacramento is a very cool place. Um, <laughs> everybody's saying it's looking amazing so far. So oh, this is really fun you. to watch you sketch. And are you just using a, a basic brush or is it just like a round brush? Yeah, I'm, I'm using, here I could show you. Um, I'm using the mapping pen um, in the vector brush section. Oh, okay, cool. Um, and it works really well for me for sketching. I feel like it moves exactly the way that I want it to. Um, awesome. And yeah. I I don't know. I really like I like the way it, it looks. It makes me happy. Yeah, I like how you're doing all the all the draw throughs <laughs> with the lines and the energy and the shapes and you're not worrying about going over any of these spots and just letting them this this is how you sketch people. This is good. This is, Thank you. you. Know, don't, don't worry about you can clean it all up later, but yes. you want to make sure the energy's there. And I, I like that. Thank you. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I always feel like sometimes I'm like, dang that sketch look, had like so much more movement than when I put the line art in, you know? <laughs> yeah, it is, it's true. Trying to translate the energy into a, a final piece can be tricky sometimes. Um, yeah. I, it really can be. So. Trying to give them some you wanna, piercing. You want to catch that initial energy that, that you, what you created it with. Yeah. Okay. I think that these are my boyfriends. Look at them. This one's in there. there we go. <laughs> well oh my gosh they're so cute already wow all right. i love them okay all right we ready to ready to move on we are we're ready okay i'm initiating it okay we've got let's see pick a number everybody five eight and thirteen are out so let's see what we get next i have my iced coffee someone say 16 just go for it just go for the last one <laughs> <laughs> I dare you. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. <laughs> Drum roll.
Hey guys, I'm just gonna let you know really quick. We're gonna do a standby for a few minutes and we'll be right back. We're back. Yeah. All right. Thanks for hanging around. Just a few little audio things we had to fix. But okay. So I think we let's see. We got some numbers here. Let me let me just make sure I'm getting the right one. Okay. I think Taylor got the first one. All right, 11. Taylor. Taylor. Right, going with eleven. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Two. Oh. There we go. All right. Big reveal. Here we go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Okay. Perfect. We got it right Perfect. after boyfriends, girlfriends. <laughs> All right. They know. All right. Let's do some girlfriend stitches. Uh, hmm. Okay. So for the girlfriends, I'll put them over here in this corner. Um. Let me think. For them, maybe. Maybe they're having me and my friends actually did this the other day. We were playing board games and the board game was called Dinosaur Tea Party. Um, and we literally made tea and we had sugar cubes that we were like putting into our tea and everything. Okay. Were so maybe they're having a tea involved? party. Yes. Yes. The dinosaurs. Okay. I was going to say, we should put some dinosaurs in there as well. Oh my God. We should. Yes. Okay. Okay. And that okay. feels very queer, so I yes. I think Girlfriend, we should. Girlfriend's uh, dinosaur tea party. Yes. Okay. So, first of all, oh, this is. Uh, let me zoom out a little bit. There we go. Okay. So let's do a little table. There we go. Let's do a little table. Get some little legs on there. Yeah. Okay, and then. Uh, let's see. The uh, the teapot will be in the middle. I've decided. Cool. And we'll get uh some coasters in there and teacups. And then I'm going to draw the girlfriends over here. Yeah, I actually want to make this a thinner line weight. There we go. That makes me feel better. Right. And then I'm going to I feel like they should have like ridiculous hats on. Of course. Because it's a tea party. And I'm going to make her have 
Nice big hair. <laughs> uh, Stephen Stephen Booth just said that uh, dinosaurs are cool. Transphobia is not. It's a T-shirt slogan over in the UK. Oh, I love that. <laughs> Maybe that can get added in somewhere. Let's. See. I know. <laughs> Maybe the <laughs> maybe the dinosaurs will be wearing uh, t-shirts. Oh yeah, I've decided the dinosaurs are gonna be like an active part of this tea party. In in our tea party, they were just on playing cards. We weren't actually having tea with dinosaurs. Um, gotcha. Just in, just in case you're confused about that. Gotcha. gotcha. Um, but uh, in this one, I think they'll they'll be there. I'm trying to think. Okay, so if I'm sitting with my little teacup and I have my pinky up, my pinky is farther away from my face. Right, right. <laughs> Sometimes I have to do it in real life for me to to know which where to put my thumbs and my pinkies. Um, just real quick. Mm -hmm. uh, if you all are joining us, this is Adobe Live Pride Week. We are here with Noah Aspen, and they are drawing some seriously cool prompts for us right now. So we're really excited. Um, after each sketch, we're going to go back to the prompt board, and we're going to pick a new number, and we're going to be doing a new sketch, which is going to be super sweet. Mm -hmm. So if you're over on YouTube, awesome. Hello. Welcome. If you're here on Behance with us, awesome. Hello. Uh, please you know, get your, get your questions in the chat. If you have any questions for Noah, or if you just want to say hi, uh, we love having everybody here. So it's going to be fun. Um, we've got about, uh, about an hour and 20 minutes left or so. So got plenty of time to do some more sketching. Yes. Uh, and I think tomorrow we're coming back and we're going to take one of these sketches, right? Yes. Just one or are we do multiple, just one, right? Um, and we're gonna I was thinking like, if if we want to, maybe we can combine two, but it's only going to be one full piece. Yes. Okay. Cool. Yeah, we're going to do one full piece using the sketches uh, here today. So definitely uh, hang around so you guys can participate in choosing the numbers that we do next. So very exciting. And we are working on the iPad, correct? Yes, on an iPad. Um, on Adobe Fresco. All right, on Adobe Fresco. Very nice. I'm going to make them very posh. They're, their eyes are closed. They're like, oh, we are just too good yes, for yes. this right now. She's going to have a tiny Delicious hat. tea. Yes. <laughs> What's your favorite kind of tea? Uh, a, well, I was going to say I, I drink a lot of black tea, but I, uh, chai tea is also very delicious. Chai tea is so good. It, it does like very specifically make me think of Christmas because of all of the uh, cinnamon that's in it. Yes, yes, I can see that. Let me yeah, see. It, I, if morning time, if I was gonna drink tea, it'd probably be like an Earl Grey or something. But hmm. or Irish breakfast. Yeah, I love peppermint tea. Um, peppermint tea is really good. I also just love peppermint anything. So. <laughs> There's that. There we go. Oh my God, they're so cute and they're too good for this tea party. Wade, Wade has a question. Yeah. Will chat be picking what we're working on tomorrow or are you going to make that decision? Um, so I was actually thinking of putting a little poll on my Instagram um okay, in my instagram cool. story um okay. and i'll pick like the like two or three that we choose from and then um yeah so if you want to be like an active participant in that um awesome. my i my instagram is aspen.aspirations um you can go into the poll um and it's a yeah good idea. oh my god they're so tiny look at how small they are um <laughs> <laughs> it's okay Right. I made them extremely tiny. They're, yeah. just, they're tiny people. The, oh know. my gosh. Yes. They're fairies. Come on. Let's be, yeah, we got to be fully inclusive here. Let's, yes. let's go. <laughs> All the fairies in the chat, they know. <laughs> Is that bad? <laughs> it works. Perfect. Okay. There we go. Um, which also I feel like means that they're like 
sitting on toadstools. Ooh, there we go. Okay. Nothing and uh, oh my gosh, a full turn. That means that the the dinosaurs are like mini dinosaurs. I want this oh. dinosaur to like <laughs> <laughs> as cartoony as possible. He's gonna have like the round teeth. He's so happy to be here. I don't even know. Maybe I, I was gonna say I don't even really know what type of dinosaur he is. Um, because he's a fairy dinosaur. He's at a, he's at a tea party. So he is. <laughs> he can be whatever kind of dinosaur. <laughs> you want to I feel like I'm going for like a, a little Barney vibe or something. He's yeah. like, yeah. Ha, 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 ha. <laughs> you see him? <laughs> I love him. Let's give him his little tail. Perfect. And then since he's sitting, his legs are like all the way up here. And they're like there we go wow look at him there we, there we go <laughs> <laughs> he said ha 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 wow just just some lesbians and their dinosaur Love there it. we go okay we did girlfriends we did boyfriends we did yep coloring on the sidewalk and we've done cuddling so let's see what we're gonna do next let's bring up our prompt there they are okay everybody we are going to do the next number so please please choose one in the chat. chat and the first one we see we will choose yes Nikki Cousins says, no, I love your laugh. This is so much fun. Thank you. <laughs> and Wade had to chime in with a pun. Is it a chinosaur? Oh my gosh. Uh, yes, it's a chinosaur. If I colored it, like if that's the one that we end up coloring, he, we're going to have to design the dinosaur after like a chai latte or something. Wade, Wade once again overshadows my hosting abilities. <laughs> <laughs> okay uh looks like let's see steven booth i think you already got a number let me see maybe not maybe i'm i'm gonna have to remember these so people right. get to... <laughs> okay let's do number three okay I'm writing down writing down your name steven number Make three sure. do, do, do. <gasps> your choice steven there we go there we go. All right, Steven, you get to choose what I do. This is a very big responsibility on your part. Okay. What's your choice? What's your what choice? What is the choice? What were, what were the ones I was saying before? I was like, you could do a picnic. Picnic, I think was one of them. I or said flying kites. Flying kites. Um, Gay people in space. Um, Gay space. Yeah, <laughs> we we got to be up there too. Um, <laughs> uh, let's see what else. Uh, maybe D and D, like some people D &D. playing a campaign. I mean, yeah, you could be doing some kind of board game. That would be yeah. Um, yeah. What do we do? We have any ideas? Are you also saying uh? <laughs> yeah, we're waiting. We're waiting for a response. Maybe plant okay. gardening. Maybe some Ooh, people gardening. Gardening. Okay, mm -hmm. I like I like that one. <laughs> you said hmm, maybe someone should put that down as a choice. <laughs> yeah, why didn't you put these on there? I don't know. <laughs> I thought of them now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, St St Steven says the Stonewall sign on the ISS. <laughs> Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Let's do the like, Google search. <laughs> Don't know. Little... Let's see. Let's look it up. Is 
think we're gonna go i don't know it's up to you noah i was thinking uh -huh. more like figurative right like we're trying to do yeah yeah pe people yeah based. Okay. i want to be able to so i but i think what they're saying is the stonewall like neon sign um right. let me see and i think yeah in space like on the international space oh station. on the international space station yeah <laughs> <laughs> and you know, right. correct me if i'm wrong but no, i think no, that, no, is... that makes sense yeah yeah <laughs> i might i'm gonna take some creative liberties with it um okay <laughs> <laughs> okay i have my reference photos up for myself um and it's literally just a screenshot of the stonewall sign and i also can see um i can see what the international space station looks like but i think what i'm gonna do is i'm going to draw them in like inside of the international space station um Sweet. and the sign is gonna like be there as if as if it's one of the compartments of Perfect. the National Space Station. Man, Noah, look at you. Look how accommodating. <laughs> this is a, look at that crushing Thank you. It. Thank you. Thank you. No challenge too great. <laughs> yes. Uh, Fearl this fearless. Fearless sketching. <laughs> yes. Uh, okay. So this is going to be our little door opening. Um. <laughs> I've decided that these these this is how the doors look on the international Perfect. space station. That's exactly how they look. Yeah, <laughs> I've been there actually, yeah. and, and that's how they look. Pretty, um, yeah, pretty common knowledge. That's right. Like, the, yeah, it's a space door. <laughs> um, then above the door, so that everyone knows what's going on in this part of the space station, is the Stonewall in sign <laughs> so it's kind of like a little t <laughs> and it's connected to the wall and there there's words in the top that i do not know what they say so they're gonna look like this right here but then Perfect. down the thing it says Stonewall. There we go. And then <laughs> in is like this. And I'm also going to change up the sign a little bit because in my brain, it has uh, like lights going around it. Like nice little neon you know what I mean? outline. Like the, or little... You're thinking like the circular little light yeah. bulbs. Yeah. There we go. Because yeah, this is, you know, no. what? <laughs> oh, no, go ahead. Go ahead. I was going to say, this is like the refurbished version because it's in space. You know, it's not. Yeah, the of course. Original it's got to work in space. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> they got to leave the original one where it is. You right. Know, right. We did not take the original one in space. This was commissioned um, for the ISS specifically. Exactly. Yes. 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 Yeah. Mel DeMello. Uh, said that uh was doodling along but i'm stumped for this one <laughs> we're like oh my god it's okay but, but we're so excited that you're doodling along I, which is yes. actually super that's fun and that's kind of the best part is when uh everybody's participating on their own at home yeah you kind of always hope that everybody's happy. sketching and drawing while they're watching this yes i love that and it would be really cool if like you end up like posting what your interpretation of the prompts was because oh, that'd be uh, awesome yeah I, I would want to see those. Um, so I'm making this like it's it's an active like club on the ISS. So there's like a rope where they're like, okay, you can't get in. Um, and Ooh. and there's also gonna be a, a space bouncer. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and great. they're gonna be like, you know, looking angry like bouncers do. They always look very intimidating. I remember, 
I one time I almost didn't get into a bar because I what happened? I think I like lost my ID or something. Mm-hmm. And uh I only had <laughs> I had my like like the paper version of your ID that they give you. Right, um, the temporary. Yeah, before you get yours. Mm-hmm. Um and uh I'm making that their top lip. Sometimes I like to just draw top lips and then I don't I I don't draw bottom lips or I just put like a little line for the bottom lips. Yeah, it's a nice, um, nice stylistic choice. Yeah, it's it's very fun. Um but yeah, so I only had like my little paper version and uh then there we go. I gave them like a foam mullet. Um and the person was like you're killing me. You're killing me with your paper ID right now. <laughs> like, you know what my job is, right? Do you understand? Right. <laughs> yeah. I had to, I had to um, do some, some door watching for a little bit in San Francisco. Not a, it's not a very fun job. Oh, um, I believe it. Yeah. Everybody directs all of their anger towards you. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> you're like having a bad day. Fault. Yeah, that drink costs too much. My friends yes. not being nice. Whatever it is, you you get you get the brunt of it. And you're like, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, sorry that I made these decisions all on my own. <laughs> <laughs> I own this club. I love this. Yeah, I'm putting them in the full like astronaut gear, even though they are on it. It is their uniform. Um. So yes. they have they have to wear it. <laughs> but this is, you know, when you're, you know, when you're doing sketches and stuff, we, we really want to make sure people know what's going on. This is a good, good artistic choice here. I Thank like you. It. I had like a period of time where like all I was doing was drawing uh, astronauts because I was just like super into space. Mm -hmm. Um, So I have like a basic idea of like what I want my space outfit to look like. This is an interesting leg that I've decided to draw right here. Um, Yeah. I'm gonna fix it up a little bit. (laughs) Yeah, fix it in post. We'll do yeah, it that's, true, that's true. That's true. That's <laughs> true. <laughs> I want to give them a chunky boot because it has to be like a fashionable spacesuit. He's upset. He has a wide stance. Look at him. <laughs> He's tall. <laughs> Look at those platforms. Yes. Uh, he deserves them. He went to space school. I like it. Maybe he has like the thingy on in the back too. That would be so yeah. annoying. He's like in the space station. He's like, oh, I gotta. I have this pack on. There we go. That's our bouncer. That's our Stonewall Inn inside of the International Space Station. Maybe I have like a little window where we can see Earth. Oh man. We really thank you, Steven. This was the this might be the wildest one, I think. On, <laughs> on just... No, thank you. I need uh, I need challenges. Uh, there's going to be one more your choice left in there. All right. So that's going to be the little window where you can see outside. There they are. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Love him. Okay. So Stonewall in at the ISS. Okay. <laughs> okay. That was crazy. So good. All right. All right. We are moving <laughs> moving on to the next one. Yes. Do we are there any more your choice or is that one, one more? more. Okay, there's one more floating out there. Mm-hmm. All right, everybody. Uh send in your 
number choice and we will see which prompt we will be doing next. And Noah, just so you know, it mm -hmm. is 1025. So we got about an hour left. Oh my God. So you, so you got the time in your head. You're like, speed it up. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're fine. Well, I figured too. It's like, whatever we get to, we get to, right? Like, there's right, no, exactly. There's no wrong way to do this. So it's uh it's it's all good that's very true we know. don't have to finish them we don't have to finish them. no no, no, no. <laughs> we want these to be fun we want this to be yes fun. Uh, going with the flow oh man i think what is someone gonna go with the number one number one or 16 <laughs> you're like do it go for it Cowards. all right uh julia judkins comes in <laughs> with number 12. all right julia let's see Celebration. Okay. Right, that's a good one. So something I think of when I think of celebration actually um, is like those like big moments. And um, one of the big moments that I actually got to be there for a friend recently was during their graduation. Um, they graduated with their masters. So it was Ooh. like, yeah, it was a big one. Yeah. And like, uh, sometimes when, you know, you are queer or trans, your chosen family is the family that comes to your graduation. And that was happening right. a lot during the ceremony. Um, a lot of people were thanking their chosen family for being there. Um, and yeah, it just like, it really, it really puts things into perspective of like how much your, your friends and your community like matter, especially as you go into adulthood and you make your own decisions about like, who you are and where you want to be in life and mm -hmm. uh yeah so when i think of celebration i think of that moment of being there for my friend's graduation awesome, awesome. that's great that you could be there for them yeah this is and gonna it's obviously be... a pretty big moment <laughs> yeah <laughs> no it's not i i like watched them go through that that was uh, that was a really big Feet, you know yes i'm super proud what they get their masters in um i <laughs> do you know <laughs> i um do have adhd um but um i want to say that it was in um like gender studies okay. um but ezra i'm sorry if i got it wrong <laughs> sorry ezra <laughs> Just so everyone knows, this is that's how diplomas look. That's what they say. Yes, uh, <laughs> just a big diploma cross. Mm -hmm. Very important, so everybody knows. <laughs> um, and then I'm going to draw some people cheering them on. All right. And their their hands are going to be in the air so that everyone knows that they're they're cheering them on. They're going to be like, wow. <laughs> <laughs> We're celebrating. <laughs> yeah, we are celebrating. <laughs> uh, some confetti. Yeah, I'm definitely doing confetti. That's going to happen. Yes, absolutely. Yeah, Sin, Sin Lago says uh, chosen families are powerful. So powerful. Very true. We got to throw a peace sign in there because um, we're gay. Um, got to get go. in there. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> and, and, the, and then the other hand is going to be like <laughs> Which one's throwing the confetti? Is it on the right of the left? Yeah, this 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 one right here. They're gonna okay, be... okay, there we go. <laughs> just just so you know, I'm gonna draw yeah. more confetti, but that's that's okay. how you you know which sure one. Make sure it gets in there. You yeah. said, listen, Pretty... if you don't put confetti, I'm gonna be so 
so upset. Yeah, you're gonna be you're not gonna be hitting it. It's gonna be missing something. It needs that other element. It does. Christian says that uh, we might need to add a cowbell in there as well. Always, oh my gosh! Always need yes, more cowbell. Christian. Okay, since I put this person's hand in a fist, um, they'll be the person with the cowbell. Cowbell. <laughs> <laughs> Chat, if you ask, you shall receive. Yes. <laughs> Noah has been very awesome. <laughs> very accommodating mm-hmm. with all of your choices. <laughs> and we'll see. Their eyes are going to be closed because they're screaming so loud. They're like, yeah! You know? Yeah, yeah. As they should <laughs> be. Give them a t shirt because it's hot outside. Maybe, maybe this person has long hair, and this person, this person, hmm, I'm gonna give you some bangs. I think I'm going to end up giving you a mullet. Yeah. <laughs> you get a mullet. You get a mullet. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone gets a mullet. Everyone gets a mullet. They're back, baby. They're they back. are. And they, and as they should be. Some people have little tiny, like, circle eyebrows, and I literally love them. There this person will have a have normal eyebrows. Um, let's see. At first, I thought those were just little eyes. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. It's a no, frog, frog no, no. person. Yes. <laughs> oh, here's their eyes. There we go. They're so happy. They're just yelling. Um, this person, I'm going to give you a tank top. Could be warm there. Could be a nice sunny day. Yeah, it's a nice. It's May, you know. Yep, um, nice celebration. Yep, graduation. So at least over here in California, that means that it's hot. So yes, this is true. <laughs> I I know some people who are like, it's literally um, it's... snowing where I'm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's still snowing here. <laughs> Do, do, do. Looks like I've me. cursed. I've cursed your other character. Christian says, "Now I can only see them as eyes." No. <laughs> <laughs> please. It'll it'll make sense later. It'll it will. Sense it later. will. It will. In in post, as we continue yeah. to say. Accident um. post. <laughs> Yay! Okay. That's also going to be like some sounds from the cow. Uncle Erico wants to add some colors, but we got to keep these sketchy. Yes, these ones are, we are, we are. Tomorrow, come come back tomorrow and we are going to be playing around with color. And it's, yes. oh wait, I wanted to show you first. <laughs> Here they are. Yay. Celebrating uh, graduation. Graduation, masters, what? Yes. Uh, uh, cowbell, we got confetti. Um, that person has normal eyes, not tiny ones. <laughs> um, yes, so that is our celebration. All right. But yeah, tune in tomorrow. That's when we're going to be working with color. Um, but for today, we're keeping everything very sketchy. Okay, we are back to our pride prompts. So the way that this is working, if you guys are just joining us, is once we bring this up, we're going to say, guys, please choose a number. And everybody in the chat, chime in with whatever number of choice you have and whatever's left, whoever's first, we will choose. And we'll just be keep doing it until either time runs up or the numbers run out. Yeah. But super fun. And we're here again with Noah Aspen. Thank you again for joining us today. And just so everybody knows, this is Adobe Life Pride Week. We're super happy to have everybody here and have such an inclusive, fun time this week with everyone. So please stick around even after this. There's so many more fun things happening after this. And also these things stay on YouTube 
on Behance. This gets archived. So if you miss anything, please come back and join. Or if you miss the beginning of the feed, you guys can always go back and watch it. So, Woo. all right, we got a number. Okay. You ready? You ready yes, for it? I'm ready. All right. Christian LeBron, Woo. number seven. Christian. All right, let's do it. <gasps> Christian, you got to choose. You got the oh, last boy. one. Man, we got those ones quick. I, I know. Sure get those. <laughs> All, right. All right. Christian, you wanted to make a heavy decision today. Yeah. This is, <laughs> this is it. This could change everything. <laughs> Christian could do it. I believe in him. <laughs> Come on, Christian. Yes. Uh, He's like sweating, thinking right now. Like, oh God. Yeah. <laughs> Christian yeah, is actually. Uh, there's, there's a scream in the chat. Ah! <laughs> yeah. And the panic has set in. Yes. <laughs> I thought you were going to choose for me. <laughs> no. That we'll was, go back that over some him. of the alternates. It was Picnic. Yes. Uh, kite picnic. Fly. Oh, okay. He's. Oh. We already got one. Turtle Buddies. <gasps> Turtle Buddies. Turtles Sorry, buddies. turtles are one of my favorite animals. Um, oh, perfect. So, yes, it is perfect. <laughs> Christ Christian says I was sweating. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> okay, we're going to draw them here. Oh, my God, they're going to be so cute. Also, this, like, uh, this, I just, I'm going to draw them in love. <laughs> I love them. Oh yeah. My God. No, turtles are the best. Yeah, turtles are so cute. Um, my mom has two turtles. Um, the my what mom. Kind? Do you know? Yes, um, a red-eared slider and a box mm -hmm. turtle. Okay, um, cool. And uh, or a tortoise for the box tortoise. Um, and um, and one of them is named. Uh, honey cornbread. She's the one who is uh, the box tortoise. Um, and then <laughs> there's a there's a story with the red-eared slider. Um, his name is uh, Sir Stumps a lot, and the reason is because <laughs> um, his little feet were like eaten off by an animal before. My Ooh. mom's my mom's a vet tech, um, and so um the he was like brought into uh the clinic um mm. and he just grew little stumps back um so he can Aww. still swim around and everything um and then so for short we call him stumpy um Aww. and i love so him cute. he's great <laughs> so I'm glad he's still able to get around and function yeah awesome. he is uh, and, and fun when you lose your <laughs> legs and try to thankfully so he kind of grew him back a little bit he like, did I mean, it's I, actually weird for me to see regular red-eared sliders now because i'm like, like i'm not Whoa. used to this yeah, yeah. <laughs> used to stumps exactly i kind of want to give some variation on uh these little pieces on the back i like it Maybe this one will have polka dots. Nice. So, you know, obviously we see tortoises that look like this in the wild all the time. The classic polka dot tortoise. Um, <laughs> they're so cute. Okay, let's see. How should I do? They got little heads and they're very, they're so, so happy to see each other. They're like, oh my God, you're here <laughs> and I love you. <laughs> this one, oh my God. Turtle Look buddies. at them. Turtle buddies. Uh, This is, uh, uh, you know, one of the quicker ones, but uh, I love turtles so much. I don't think you need much. The purity of the, the love between turtles. Look at them. <laughs> the turtle buddies. Thank you, Christian. That was a good suggestion. <laughs> it looks like they're on the space station. Yeah, maybe they are. Maybe the... that's the one you, you can buy. <laughs> 
<laughs> the bouncer is like, you cannot come into the club. Little does no one know that we are combining all of the sketches <laughs> into one <laughs> giant painting. <laughs> <laughs> They're all gonna be cohesively together. <laughs> all right. Well, that was a quick one. We're back in the prompts. Mm -hmm. So again, everybody in chat, please choose a number, whichever one's first. We will go ahead and reveal. We've got one, two, four, six, nine, ten, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Go big. Yes. Let's go, people. <laughs> Come on, go big. Let's do it. Aren't you curious? Yeah. It was choosing the in betweens. <laughs> What's the next one? What's the next one? You got this. Exciting. I like this. I am. That. I'm also very excited. Um, there's no more your choice. All of your choices have been taken. Okay. We've got, we've got, we've got a winner here. All right. Uh, Mary Roby uh, picks oh. number 10. Oh, okay. Cool. Let's see. Pride Frog! Uh, what a great one! I said Pride one. Flag at first, and I was like, no, it's Pride Frog! <laughs> <laughs> so much better. That was a good suggestion, Maddie. I love it. Okay, let's see. So, Pride Frog. So, we just did turtles. Um, let's do the frogs over here. Um, okay, so... We can do this a couple different ways, but I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to have him chilling. He's going to be really happy to be a frog, as he should be. I feel like if, yeah. if I were to be anything, a frog would be it, you know? You're, you're I've, I've always gone with a bird. I'm just like, I just want to fly. Yeah. Fly. Yeah. Flying's my thing. I want to just be able to fly above everything else. Any any type of eagle, I would be super stoked. So do you like going on airplanes? Oh, yeah. I love I love airplanes. Yeah. I'm, I mean, I, you know, traveling, you know, in an airplane for like 15 hours isn't my favorite. Right. Right. Yeah. <laughs> I, I've been I've been skydiving a few times and uh, what? I always, I always wanted to get into a, a a jet and see if you know do the passenger experience, but right. Yeah, we'll we'll see. I feel like as I'm getting older, my uh, my tolerance for motion sickness is <laughs> getting less. Yeah, you you gotta you gotta do it now. I know. Do it do it as your holiday gift to yourself. You know. Yes. Like look, babe. I'm going up in a jet plane. Yes. You got the kids, right? Right. Because <laughs> if something happens, you got the kids, right? right? <laughs> You're like, are you prepared to lose? This could be it. <laughs> could just pass out and just eject me from the. I don't know. Right. Do you have plans in place? Yeah. How's our life insurance policy looking? Right. <laughs> I, okay, uh, I like this frog. Thank you. I love him too. Um, he's like. Is this frog gonna be holding a flag? <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> I was like, how? I was like, how are you gonna do the the pride? pride? Part? Like, yes. Okay. <laughs> this it all makes sense now. Yes. Yes. Uh, the the frog is holding the flag. People are stoked on the uh, the frog. Oh, thank you. And then choo -choo -choo. I'm not counting the colors, so um, I'm assuming that's as much as a rainbow. Tisk, uh, tisk, tisk. <laughs> you said count your colors. <laughs> I'm going to give them a little hearts. Um, also a lily pad. Love it. Um, maybe you get like a little flower on the lily pad yeah look at him pride frog Yay. another little quick one i love him wow beautiful chilling chilling with the sidewalk chalk yes 
<laughs> okay. We're filling up right. this page. I'm excited okay. to see how it looks at the end. We All still right, got like back. half of the choices, right? That's exciting. We're still, we're still doing okay. Yeah, we've got a few more here. All right, we're back at the pride prompts. So go ahead and choose a number. And the first one that comes up in chat will be our next prompt. The suspense is building. I know. <laughs> Every time. You should have like a number ready in your keyboard, you know, so that you could be like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 got one, two, four, six, nine, 14, 15, 16. Uh, no one said, yeah. I'm, they said, I'm not touching the end of it. <laughs> yeah. I'm not touching either end. Right. Oh, <laughs> oh. Hold on. I, I spoke too soon. Charlie's coming in. Hey. One. Number one. one yes. Number one. All right, Charlie. All right, Charlie. Let's see. <gasps> Community. Yeah. What a good one. It's perfect. It's perfect Community's... for our Adobe Live community. Yes. Uh, yes. Community is so important to me. Um, I feel like uh, it's so cool how people connect and support each other um Definitely. and i i feel like when i lived in like larger cities it was harder for me to uh connect to community because i was like where do i even start you know right. um and being in sacramento has been really like different i've i feel like i've been able to connect to community really easily um and it has been life-changing for me yeah no i mean it's it, it is like you said it is everything i mean uh I, that was i mean the art same thing with the art it was just finding the going to art shows and being part of an artist community and yes like, all uh, of a sudden these people it's like you know it's like nobody's questioning why you're making art anymore you know like no one's questioning you're just like yeah of course yeah of course that's what right. we all do this is yeah you make art because you're obsessed with it and you couldn't do anything else and you'd be miserable without it yeah so, yeah you know a community is so important for for anything that you do you love or who you are so um it's always Ooh, something to be celebrated that noise is great <laughs> can you hear that are you are we good I don't, okay no i is it <laughs> is it a temporary temporary thing it is um okay. but yeah just let me know if it gets distracting you got it you got it um but yeah i i definitely i definitely agree what i'm actually going to be drawing here is um we do picnics in sacramento um and all of like the queer community kind of gets together and listens to music and hangs out and yeah it's just um it's really nice and that, I mean, that's, would love that yeah that's what that's what i wanted to capture here um so i'm having two people taking a selfie um sometimes people are drawing and doing art while listening to music. Maybe I'll draw like a little Maybe some uh, yummy, radio. yummy foods. Maybe some yummy foods there. Oh my gosh, yes, yes, yes. We have to draw yummy food. What are what is one of your favorite things to have? Um like oh, I mean I'm into the I'm into the charcuterie boards. Yes. Um, meat meat, cheese, and fruit. I'm I'm all about if you want to bring any of those to a party. <laughs> I agree um i like i love um like pepperoni uh oh okay there you go <laughs> and uh so if i <laughs> once the other day we were actually at a party and there was a charcuterie board um and actually i might want to bring that let me let me draw this person's legs first and then i will draw the charcuterie board oh, um <laughs> the charcuterie board is more important than their legs <laughs> yeah um but uh yeah the, i was at a party the other day and there there was a charcuterie board and uh 
I they were like, okay, take whatever you want home. Um, and I literally just grabbed the pepperonis and I was like, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have perfect. to go out and get these. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what I'm going to do is bring it forward. Maybe make this blanket a little bit bigger. Maybe go. draw like a little tree above them. Because it's hot outside and we need a shade. Need some shade. Um... The cheese will have like a section of it cut out in the classic cheese way. Yes, of course. So that everyone looks at that and they're like, oh, that's cheese. Uh, Wade says, it's fun to say charcuterie, which I agree. And I have a funny story about that. Okay. I think I was probably like 26, 27, and uh -huh. I had never heard that word before somehow. Really? I don't know how I lived that long without hearing that word. <laughs> And I remember I was with my uh, then girlfriend, now my wife, uh, uh -huh. at a bar in Oakland. And I was like, what? And I'm looking at the menu. I'm like, what is a charcuterie? <laughs> She's like, a charcuterie board? And I was like, I don't know what that is. <laughs> She's like, you know, like with like cheese free. I'm like, that's what it's called? I thought it was just called a cheese board. <laughs> You're like, so, wow. Yeah, felt late to the party. It's uh, okay. Yeah. Sometimes no. you just, they just don't pass. Yes. Your path. You know, they don't cross paths with words sometimes that you think you should have already. No, I agree. It's kind but of I like. I logged that real quick. I was like, I'm never forgetting this word. And now <laughs> you said that's why. I... Yeah, I was going to say that's why you brought it up, like, right when I was talking about. Uh... I feel like my 30s have been full of charcuterie. You know, like, oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it comes, much. Up, it comes up a lot more as you get older. Yeah. You're like, wow, yeah. I, I just see charcuterie boards everywhere all the time. Yeah. <laughs> um, I guess I've decided that it's a little windy today because I gave this person a beanie. So I'll take that. Yeah, they're gonna be wearing a sweater. Which is the? I'm gonna put a heart on the sweater. What about some leaves, kind of like? Ooh, like blowing through the breeze. Yeah, maybe this is an autumn day. Maybe this is a little. Oh, bit that would be sweet. I love autumn. Like, oh yeah, it is my favorite time of year. Uh, it's just like it's so pretty when everything is orange and red and yellow. Mm -hmm. It just makes me so happy. Yeah, I I love the. As the weather cools down and not not in LA as much. Like <laughs> yeah. Sometimes yeah. it's like 95 in October. I'm like, come on. <laughs> um, I definitely miss, I miss that part about uh, the Bay. I know Sacramento can get pretty hot, so it's not as not as uh, temperate there. Right. But... So, um, it does, but I, it does cool down for the for the fall months. Like it doesn't like get cold but it cools right. down and then so yeah. it, it i at least i'm like eh, it feels like fall and that makes me happy <laughs> mushrooms yeah, make me like, feel like fall so i'm gonna throw some in here throw some in there mm -hmm. okay so this person is uh, smiling having a good time and then this person is taking a selfie with them. Um, I think I'm going to give them a bun. Nice. Is this our first bun? It is our first is our bun. First bun. Okay. Right. First bun of the day. And then. Wade is saying that he, he loves actual season changes and i would say i would too but i've lived in california my whole life so your whole life i only, I only kind of just travel to other season changes <laughs> <laughs> but I, it's snowing here so right amazing. you're like wow this is this the place is the where the snow happens yeah. uh, i mean i guess in i guess in california you got plenty of mountains and stuff you, you can find it but that's uh, true um yeah, like if i decided to go away. to tahoe at a certain time you know yeah exactly you can you can find you can find the seasonal change it's just a little bit harder on the the coastlines yeah give them a little 
Oh my gosh, she's adorable. Um, I feel like I fall she's in love with selfie. like she is. Her head's tilted. She's like yeah. best angle. <laughs> um, since it's fall, I'm gonna give her a hoodie. I feel like because I wear hoodies so much, I'm like a pro at drawing them. I'm like, yes. oh yes. I had to yeah, work so reference. hard. Yes. <laughs> to learn how to um, make the little, the hoods look the mm -hmm. way that I wanted the, them to, because like right. for a while there, um, they would either come out like too flat you know for me or something and so just learning how to draw them in the like weight that i wanted them to be um mm -hmm. that was like a journey of mine it's i mean look cl clothed figure drawing you know figuring out how uh forms wrap around other forms uh is always a, a journey <laughs> it's I feel like I've been doing it forever and I'm still sometimes, especially with like cloth and other things, it's like, ah, how does this sitting on the body? And yeah. Like, I get this weird ellipse thing that's got to wrap around and give it dimension. And it's got to look just right. Yeah. So I, I know that feeling. I agree. I feel like, um, I feel like sometimes I let myself like go ham on the like wrinkles and everything. And then I like, come back to it and i'm like all right now what can i take away yeah pull, pull it back pull it back mm -hmm. i also do that with like shading and highlighting um i'll i'll like let myself go uh completely like as hard as i want to go on the shading and highlighting and then i'll like look at it and i'll be like okay so that part doesn't need to be highlighted <laughs> <laughs> Give him, give him some boots. There we go. I'm so excited to see, like, whoever is drawing Alana. I want to see those, like, what your interpretations of these prompts are. Got to create a, a hashtag. Oh, I do. Noah, Noah's, Noah's pride prompts or something. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Okay, wait, chat. Do you have a good hashtag for me? We need we need a hashtag so no one yeah. can see all the doodles out there. Please. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. But let me give them some drinking water. Or okay, wait. So they need a basket to put everything away in afterwards. There yeah, we go. Right. How, are you, how are you gonna carry all that delicious stuff yeah they they needed it if i didn't give it to mm. them they would have had to hold everything in their hands it's like okay you take three strawberries <laughs> right. you this you can hold the cheese right okay you get the baguette <laughs> Don't, don't, don't try to hold it for too long. I don't want everything to get all warm and gross. And right. <laughs> you could. You got pockets in your hoodie, right? Maybe just right. Put just them in stuff there. Them in there. We'll just kind of wash it when we get home. All of the baguettes. <laughs> yeah. Check, um, check it for little lint hairs. When we get yeah. Home. <laughs> I'll. I'll make. I'll give them a picture. Do we have any good hashtags in the chat? We got nothing. Nothing. <laughs> They're all thinking. <laughs> Give him a... Come on, Christian. <laughs> we need your help. <laughs> Christian, Steven, Taylor, Madi, Charlie. Look at this. I'm absorbing the names. Julia. Yeah, look at you. <laughs> ADHD. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no, it's there. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's constant. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go. They they have some drinks so that they don't get dehydrated. There we go. Very important. Mm -hmm. That is a packed. I love it. Packed picnic blanket. Yes, uh, as it should be. Look at that. This is my community drawing. Community. Love They're it. chilling, Love having it. a good time. Okay. All right. Here we go. All right. Real quick. It is 11 o'clock 
or so close to 11 o'clock. So we are an hour and a half in, which means we're going to start wrapping it up in about 20 minutes. So Noah, just so you know, mm -hmm. get your little sketch game going. You're doing great so far. We've Thank got, you. let's see, got about seven choices left here. So if we get to them all, great. If not, great. It's okay. Yeah. yeah. No and worries. If you guys are watching on YouTube, hello, welcome. Thanks for joining us. And if you're watching on my hands, hello, welcome. You guys can uh, ask questions in the chat. Ask Noah anything your heart desires. Welcome to Pride Week at Adobe Live. And let's go with the Pride prompts. Let's yeah. do it again, people. Let's pick some numbers. Give me again, a number. Again, it's whatever number comes up first is what we're going to go with. So, <laughs> and if you've already picked it, I'm going to try to choose somebody else. Just heads up. But yeah. if, if you're still in there and then we run through it, we'll, we'll get to you again. Ooh, okay. So Sin Lago says, uh, hashtag pride affirmations. Oh, I love that. That's cute. It's a good one. Are there a lot of things under that tag? Like if you go on Instagram, any I have no idea. I have no idea. <laughs> yeah, we got we gotta search it out. <laughs> All right. Uh Noah but Gadotti uh says Noah. number six. Number six. My name twin. Let's go. And sorry anybody if I'm uh, butchering your name in chat. It's uh not something I intend to do. So please correct me if I, I'm not saying your names right. So this is Pride okay, is Mushrooms. All right. All right. Here we go. Uh, listen. So when I think Fun of is the best. Uh, yes, but I I have them right here. Look at them. What? They're just hanging up on my little my little shelf. Um, I do think these mushrooms are gonna be um, sentient. Um, they're gonna have uh, little mushroom faces. I dig All right, it. Let's see. Okay, so Noah says name twin pride mushroom. Yes, uh, name twin. Okay, so here's one mushroom. Here's another mushroom. They will be dating, of course. Of course. Because why not? Um, I'm gonna give them little These faces. These are not eyebrows. These are not These are eyebrows. Eyes. These are <laughs> eyes. They're so happy. <laughs> Should I give this one eyebrows? Not like that though. They'll have like you, you little do, like. Noah. I'm not. <laughs> 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 okay, I like yes, yes. Keep the eyebrows. <laughs> Gosh, it's so cute. Okay, um, let's see. I think what I'm gonna do is like if we end up coloring these, um, I'm gonna make them um the tops of them different pride flags okay. awesome so let me see cool and then um gonna give them little hands nice Look at those little guys. Oh. Their little feet. Are they Maybe jumping for joy? Are they dancing? I like this. Yeah. An so unexpected twist. <laughs> They're so happy to be here. I'll make them jumping I mean, for joy. This one will be jumping I'm into like it. this. Yes. yes. <laughs> um, and uh, let's see. I want to add something else to these. Uh, Maybe. Oh man, Wade's Wade swinging in with another. <laughs> another pun. That's cute. They seem like a couple of fun guys. Oh my gosh! <laughs> good job, uh, Wade. Keep going. Yes. So bad it's good. Yes. Oh, of course they get little hearts, but I I don't know. Let's see. I feel like. They they need a little something extra. Um, maybe maybe they're they're holding their own little little flag. So I'll change it so that their hand is gripping it. Uh, 
And then, Ma- and then... Mari says, uh, maybe flowers at their feet? Oh, they can have flowers. And then, and then, okay, let's do like a little, a little rose. And this one will be like, and then maybe little like bundles of, uh, of lavender. Ooh, nice. Um, even though right now they are not purple, um, you know, they would be, um, <laughs> and, we can, and lavender. We can use our imagination. Yes. I'm going to actually draw some up here too. Oh, that, that one. <laughs> <laughs> that one is. Uh, That's how it was. You know, it's, it's blooming. It's it is. A, <laughs> a rough start, but it is beautiful now. It is. It is. Uh, everyone knows. Everyone knows. It's a rose. Fine. Uh, <laughs> these are our, our fun guys. Fun guys. <laughs> All right. Okay. Awesome. Awesome. Let's see. Let's see. That was another little quick sketch. Perfect. Oh, oops. I opened the oh, same that's okay. one. Okay. Let's see. Here we go. All right. Back to our prompt. Okay, everybody, got a few more left. We got Somebody this. Somebody do 14, 15, 16. Come on. <laughs> I know you're like, please, Somebody. someone says 16. Please. I'm begging They're not going to be like, no, you can't tell us what to do. <laughs> Chris, host, get out of here. All right, what's what's it going to be? I'm curious just what we got left here. You I, Do you know? Have you remembered your other prompts? Are you There's like one? one that's in my brain that I okay. definitely remember, but... Uh, other than that, uh, no. <laughs> All right, Taylor, I'm going to have to pass on you for this one. Cause you've already, you've already done one. But if, <laughs> if, if we don't get anybody else in the next minute, then or we'll two, choose then Taylor's. Okay. Julia's already chosen. We're going to see if we get, come on, let's, let's get somebody <laughs> new. Let's go. Come on, everybody. I appreciate y'all. I, I appreciate yeah, y'all. I like though. the participation. Yes. Don't, don't get me wrong. We'll she see, did pick we'll 15 see. too, so. Oh, you're like, hmm. <laughs> <laughs> like, sorry, Taylor, you already chosen. <laughs> Julie, you've chosen, but we're going to go ahead and accept your eyes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, we're going to give it one more minute and see if anybody else uh, can chime in here. Okay, cool. If anyone wants to chime in with a number, please do. Okay. There's no more your choice, so you won't have the responsibility. Nikki, Nikki Cousins, All 16. Right. Yes. Thank you, Nikki. Here we go. For some reason, right, when you deal. said when you said it, it's not, I thought it was just like one username, and so I was like, "All right, Nikki Cousins, 16. <laughs> <laughs> Which one? <laughs> yeah. Look, guys, we don't put numbers in our usernames anymore. That's from like the late '90s, early 2000s. We just let's not do that. Family. Family. Yay. Uh- all, All right. right. So, so for this one, I definitely was thinking of drawing um, like a queer couple and their child, maybe at Pride. Um, so, yeah, very excited about this. Here we go. Let's get some circles for where the heads are going to be at. And uh, just ahead of this one, uh, Sin Lagos has been saying she wants to choose 14. And okay. uh, that's uh, their birthday. So ah, I think the next one will we'll do, be 14. We'll make a special exception here. We'll do 14 next. Yay. Happy birthday. So soon. I know. It's days. coming up soon. Oh, Are wait. You... She says it was in May. Oh, well, oh happy belated okay. birthday. Well, then happy, happy belated. belated. Yes. <laughs> Mine was the 18th. We were four days apart. Oh, wow. Taurus is in the chat. <laughs> oh, yeah. 
Everyone throw your big three in the chat. <laughs> I know they will. Nikki says, Nikki says that she feels like the family also needs a puppy. <gasps> oh my gosh. Okay. Yes. Yes. I had a feeling uh, Noah would be okay with that. Yes. Uh, okay. The puppy's going to be here. Yes. Uh, Yes, we, num the numbers and the usernames like just like in the MySpace days. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> for, for sure. Let's bring him, bring him back. <laughs> Memories I don't want to remember. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, <laughs> I used to do the like aggressive like um, where like one letter's capital and the other one's lowercase oh yeah and you're like what am i gonna do of... what am i gonna yeah, <laughs> yeah. Which, what's it gonna be you want to try to read this name i don't think so right and you're like <laughs> why did Number, i do that exclamation point capital <laughs> lowercase we're also you're obsessed like, with no, it being no one <laughs> i can't i can't do it i don't know what it is the worst who who is gonna know <laughs> Yeah, Wayne. <laughs> or Wade says, what? What space? <laughs> <laughs> Literally. Yeah. yeah. It's, we're uh, aging ourselves here. I know. I'm like, oh, I actually don't know what that is. Um, Taylor's chiming in with uh, Aquarius, Virgo, and Virgo. Ooh. We got Noah, Noah with Cancer, Virgo, Taurus. Yes. Uh, uh, Julia is Capricorn, Cancer, Gemini. Oh, amazing yes good what is i don't even know what the big three is uh, was it okay it's your... taylor's explaining it Sun, oh, okay. moon, rising signs okay yes. thank you taylor yes you already answered mine and, uh, and nikki's question okay i'm I, I figured i can just look this up on the internet <laughs> you're like but instead i'll ask the chat <laughs> <laughs> no looking up my my three big signs oh okay yes yes you can um you just need There's to know websites. There's you need to know what time you were born. I do know that. I do. Okay, know then yes, you can look it up online. I'm good to go. Like the the birth chart out calculator. Um, yes. I'm a Gemini Gemini Scorpio. Is that good thing? Bad thing? Was it? <laughs> uh, yeah. Tell me, chat. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> One word answer, go. <laughs> yeah, good or bad. Yeah. <laughs> There's no nuance. All right, so what do we got in this family here? What are we looking at? Um, so I so far have drawn everyone's noses. I'm going I'm going through their faces because I'm also trying to make the child look like a mix between them. Mm -hmm. So, um, oh wow, you're going for it. We're looking, we're going for likenesses here. Yes, That's amazing. Good job, Noah. Thank you. Um, but yeah, um, they're they're gonna be at Pride, they have their dog with them. Uh, I might do the like flag in the background, like I did with the boyfriends. Um, uh M Mari might be responding uh, to your three signs, and it oh. says one one word: oof. <laughs> that that what what are your big three, Mari? Tell me. <laughs> Maybe that's yeah. I, I'm assuming that was she might have been responding to someone else. Don't don't take that personally. I just, no, I'm pretty I'm sure that they to... were responding to me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna make an assumption right there. <laughs> Maybe I'll give this person like some nice eyeliner wings. Charlie Skilling says, uh, "Double Gemini with a Scorpio rising, terrifying." <laughs> <laughs> Amazing! I really, I really like these responses here. <laughs> oh my gosh! Marty responds with uh, Pisces, Leo, Leo. She's also not great. <laughs> <laughs> Gosh, At least really you admit it. I'm really curious now. You should look at well, I'll be first back, guys. I'm gonna right? go <laughs> comb the internet and find my three signs. You, you got this, Noah, right? <laughs> I, don't, I don't need to be hosting this. You're good. <laughs> exactly, exactly. <laughs> uh, Mari says, uh, roasting is my love language. I know, yes. I know. It's true. 
There we go. I'm giving this person some curly pigtails. Maybe some. And I, I think this is going to, this might be the last one. It's oh my uh, gosh. 11 15. We got to start wrapping up in about five minutes. So um, maybe we can get one more in after this. We might we'll be see. able to. 14. Okay. Let's. Uh, Let's see if we could finish this sketch Squeeze so we dog. could do number go, 14. Go, go. I know. <laughs> <laughs> the dog's like, please. Baby pause. <laughs> oh my gosh. Adorable. Yes. And it's then. So this person. Actually, let's do no ears and let's do a hijab. I haven't drawn any of those yet. Nice. And if you guys are just joining us, we are with Noah Aspen and we are doing some really cool pride prompts, mm -hmm. which uh, they've created for us. And so I think this might be the last sketch, but we might be able to squeeze in one more, one more. is a master at sketching so we might might get there uh, but everything right now is being done in adobe fresco um just in case you guys were wondering i think we're just using a basic vector brush mm -hmm. uh, i think it's the it's it called the pen which one which one is it um it is called the mapping pen, mapping pen. There yeah go. so everything's been done in that this has been a very uh kind of keeping it keeping it simple with the sketches so that we can uh flesh out one of these tomorrow mm -hmm. during the Adobe Live. So uh thanks for joining us everybody. And if you're on YouTube, thanks for joining us as well. And everybody on Behance and in the chat. This has been awesome and fun. So keep keep rolling. Is this it? Are we this is my family. Yes, let's go to 14. Let's do 14. Here we go. Let's get one more in. This one's for you. Sam. I believe in us. Uh, okay. All right. Here we go. We're going to do it. Ice, Ice coffee. coffee. Okay, we had to one. do it. Yes. Um, Community, <laughs> family. That's all great. But iced coffee. Yes. A level above. I am going to draw someone with their iced coffee. Um, very happy. They're gonna be like, it's gonna be like a commercial. They're gonna be like looking over their shoulder. <laughs> the turn, the turn back. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Just got my iced coffee. Yeah. Feel great. The... Yeah, iced, iced coffee can always go uh, two ways for me. Either like, oh my gosh, I needed that. Or like, oh. How is there so much more caffeine in this than just my morning coffee? Yes, <laughs> but we need it. Okay, yeah. we need the caffeine. Okay, and then I'm gonna do their little nose, and they're gonna be so happy. They're like, I have my iced coffee, <laughs> all my dreams are coming true. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. I'm going to be looking over here. I think Wade just suggested ice cream coffee, which if that's the case, yes, please. Yes. Uh, I love ice yes, cream please. coffee. Yeah. What is your favorite way to put coffee into your system? I love, I love ice cream. Um, I love coffee. I love, um, I like both warm and cold coffee, which I know mm -hmm. a lot of people are like, why would you ever say that? Why would you ever say that in my presence? Because they don't like warm coffee. Um, oh, really? But for me, the feeling of like a nice warm coffee in yeah. my hand, um, especially on like a, a chilly day, it's like my favorite thing. Oh yeah, there's a time for there's a time for both. I just love I just love coffee. So yeah, I, all kinds of ways. Yeah, I love espresso. I love. Just a big giant cup of coffee, uh, you know, really strong, small, little imported, independent coffees. What, whatever, as long as it, as long as it's yummy, 
and uh, it's got caffeine in it i'm usually drinking it yes so. uh, as you should yeah and let me give her she'll have like a little purse uh N- nikki says um instead of saying cheers my husband and i started saying razzle dazzle oh my gosh that's amazing <laughs> I, can, I can see some razzle dazzle with this iced coffee yes uh, she's so happy <laughs> gonna give her some bracelets um and she's wearing a t-shirt <laughs> Noah so. says that uh, julia said the best way is via iv yes uh, <laughs> Anyone else in the chat doing it via yeah. IV? <laughs> I okay, only take caffeine intravenously. Is. That's that's a okay. That's awesome. Look at her. Look how, look how fast that was. <laughs> Thank Did you. Think you're able to squeeze that in. Yes, uh, I wanted to for the May 14th birthday. There's a well, little group of sketches. Look at all these oh. awesome sketches. Do you want to go over them real quick and then yeah. we'll move to wrapping up? Just Absolutely. So we have lesbians at a tea party with a dinosaur. Awesome. Um, we have a community in the park having a picnic. Awesome. We have some gamer couple cuddling together. Yeah. We have the Stonewall Inn sign on the International Space Station. That was a, that was a tough one. <laughs> We have two turtles who are in love. They were turtle buddies. We have these boyfriends at a pride parade. We have this person with their iced coffee in hand. We have this family also at a pride parade. We have this uh, friend just drawn on the sidewalk with chalk. We have right here a frog with the pride flag hanging out, having a good time. We have some chosen families celebrating um, one of their people getting their diploma. Um, And I, oh, and we have the 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 fun guys. The fun guys. Yeah, the fun guys. (laughs) Well, uh, Noah, this was awesome. Yes. Totally unexpected. <laughs> uh, perfect way for me to join in with the Adobe Live Pride Week. Um, so just let us know what's going to be happening day two. Yeah. Which will be tomorrow. Yes. Yeah, so tomorrow. So what I'm going to do tonight is I'm going to, or after the stream, actually, I'm going to pick like two or three of these, put them on my Instagram story, and I'm going to do a poll to um, see which one y'all would like me to turn into a fully realized piece tomorrow. We're going to be using color. We're going to be doing line work. We're going to be rendering. um, And then we're going to have a beautiful piece for you at the end of our time together. Well, that's that's awesome. And I'm so excited. Um, We're going to be back here tomorrow morning 9 30 a.m pacific standard time and no and i will be back for drawing in adobe fresco uh no be adding color full scene to the doodle they drew this is going to be rad i'm excited to see kind of what gets chosen as well like Me too. So, <laughs> go over to the instagram go choose um also stick around for a pride themed oh, week of oh go ahead also quick. really quick the um the hashtag that we chose was um was I think it was pride affirmations right yes pride affirmations do hashtag pride affirmations um so that i can see what your interpretation of the prompts was because I, I really do want to see it awesome awesome yes very very important um, so stick around for a pride theme week of creative challenges with Andrew Hawk rattle, followed by how to build an e-commerce mobile app in XD with Brandon gross. Thank you so much, Noah. I'm thank excited to do this again me. tomorrow and thank you everybody who joined and followed along. Hope you guys had a great time and stick around. There's yeah. more, but also we'll see you tomorrow. See you Bye, tomorrow. Everyone. Bye.